All right now, boys and girls, we want to introduce... Please allow me to adjust my pants. Woo, woo, woo. Run as fast as you can. I'm gonna give you what you need. Get ready for BAM Radio. Let me do it one more time. It's Radio BAM, fucking idiot. What the hell am I talking about? It's Radio BAM! And now... And now... Here's BAM! Here's BAM! All right, quick intro. We got D. Camello, Shit Bird, Shit Goose, Novak, and me. And Novak is yeah, pissed. I'm fucking fed up, man. I'm going to well, tell you why right now. I fucking decided to leave this broad last night in Philly. I bang her out. I got to go, man. Job done. And I get in this cab. My ride leaves. $100 cab ride. He won't take me home. So the closest destination is that minging whore named Natalie. She was my friend. Was. Keyword was. Oh, that doesn't sound and, uh, the, He was missy. I saved her pussy. You remember that broad, guys and girls out there? So uh, um, I'm knocking on the door, right? My battery's dead. I'm out of options. It's like 4 a.m. I'm shit-faced, walking up the side of 202. If a cop comes by, I'm fucking gone, man. I got warrants and shit. Dude, I got so, warrants, too. You're cool. Shut yeah, up. What kind of warrants do you have? <laughs> Parking. Pissing in public. <laughs> Parking. <laughs> yeah, tough guy. Parking. Yeah. So anyways, I'm banging on the door, right? And I hear I hear someone on the side. I'm like, what the f- Why aren't they answering? And... uh. I'm knocking, knocking, knocking. They won't come, so I'm like, wait, this is an apartment complex. The police will be called in a minute. I it's a leave. worthless Belgian boy boy oh, yeah. who's scared to answer the door, and he goes, Natalie, who's this long-haired freak with one of those hats that Bam wears, but he's wearing it backwards? Hey, who is this? Hey, Waffle Boy, I'm devoting the next month worth of shows to ruining your fucking life, homo. <laughs> Waffle His Boy. His name is Paul Waffle something. Boy. Yeah, Paul Waffle Boy, Belgian Boy, won't let uh, <laughs> Natalie hang out with any of us because he thinks that we're like lower cra- class scumbags. Yeah, look at we Wonder are. Boy's bank account, though. Fuck <laughs> it. The thing is, he thinks I want to bang her out. I, I don't want to fuck her, man. Her pussy looks like my asshole. And if you've seen it, it is mean. <laughs> you know, I don't want that in my life. <laughs> I, I, I do my mom before her, bro. I think oh, I got photos Yeah, of but that. you liked her company. Liked. Keyword, bam, and missy. I know, I know. So, I'm just, oh, man. She, I just can't believe it. She's like, oh. Oh, oh, oh Jessel Toll. I brought the artwork to Jess is in so, the house. Nat- Natalie, this is what I'm figuring out. He's probably got his dick knee deep in a wet pussy right now. Why do you care about this dude, man? Like, why? What the f- why? 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 The thing that pisses me off is that he finds every reason to leave, like her house. Like he comes back for one day. Gee, shut the fuck up! If you want to talk, go out there. <laughs> you sure. sound like a school thing. <laughs> but but no, like Sorry, like teacher. gee. I'm gonna fucking throw these cigarettes at you. No, I'm gonna get my BB gun. <laughs> no, 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 not the BB gun. <laughs> so, uh. Uh, oh, God! Uh, what do you know? Are you uh, gonna keep talking shit now that she's listening? Yeah, the whore that dates Belgium faggot. Yeah, alright, let's talk to her. No, you know what? But, yeah, fuck you. You know what? Fuck you. What? You're gonna say fuck you to me? Yeah, you made me walk up 202 at 4 a.m. and almost get arrested, dude, because of your cheating ass homo waffle eating boyfriend who's got his dick knee deep in pussy, but not him. yours right now. Brandon, you were knocking on my door. If, if somebody was banging down Mandy's door at fucking two thirty in the morning, Ooh, she's a whore too. She's a whore too. She's she's probably banging out a Ravens player right now. Who cares? <laughs> Are you still talking? It's worthless, dude. Yeah, Did she get that Brazilian <laughs> wax? Yo, Belgian boy finds every reason that he can to leave your ass, and that was the most worthless reason, dude. Natalie, he totally is just he. You you say yes. To, you're a yes girl to him. You'll just say, oh yeah, come over at any time. Yeah, that's the reason why he walks all over you, Does, and you're gonna keep doing. Doing it too because I just told Shitbird some stuff to say and he ain't gonna do it. Does the Belgian boy know that I ate your pussy out a week ago? You did not do that a week ago and you didn't do that. Lie all you want, man. <laughs> I don't. I don't lie on my dick because it's a curse. If, as soon as I lie on my dick, I don't get pussy. I know that for a fact. The one thing I don't lie about is pussy, and I did eat yours, and I regret it. It was pretty minging. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I like it, dude, but I was I was walking up 202 at 4 a.m. hiding in bushes when a car came by. Why couldn't you just come that's home? my fault. Why didn't you fucking call me? Yeah, my why battery's is it dead. Fa- oh, battery's dead? Okay. Yeah, you but why is that her fault? Because she knew I was there. You know Belgian boy was like, oh, there's a dirt bag at the door. <laughs> well, <he's been> <laughs> well, I didn't know who the fuck it was because you haven't been here in fucking forever. I haven't seen you in forever. And I wanted to, and I was like, I was scared. I didn't know who the fuck it was. So he Too went late. to the door and he looked through and he didn't say anything. He didn't even know who it was. He doesn't know who you are. So like, he, you have no he'd out. Be like, there's a random guy at your door. Like, what, what the fuck? That makes me look awful. <laughs> You'll never be forgiven, dude. Why would I never be forgiven? What did I do to you? I, I didn't know the what the fuck did you do to me? You had me ducking in bushes on the side of 202 every time I saw headlights coming in my direction because oh, I can't that's walk. My the fucking street. fault. Why did you leave fucking Philly? Because I fucked her and I was done. 
How long did it take you to get home? I you dip your fucking mini hard dick in some dick bucket, and then <laughs> yeah, you but... fucking takes your a minging ass to the street, so you have to fucking get a taxi ride back here into my fuck, because I didn't answer my fucking door? Yeah. A mi yeah, how yeah, how can you talk bucket. about how dirty these bras are? I fuck your, uh, your pussy is worse looking than my asshole. Really? Are you kidding me? You ate it, kid. You're always wasted. I ate it, bitch. I saw it, shaved it, and ate it. Shut up. <laughs> what? Yeah, I like you, but you make poor decisions. Therefore, you're on the road to nowhere, babe. Do you use any condiments? Who? <laughs> <laughs> you know, it gotta be safe and shit. All right, Natalie, bro. why don't you just break up with Belgian boy? He sucks. He walks all over you. I love him. I do. Yeah, I love but, him. And yeah, but, but he's, he's gonna keep walking all over. I love Michelle. She got fingered at the fucking beach. I put up with it, and then as soon as I got over it, I was like, thank God I, w I wasted only five years on the bitch. I could <laughs> How can you say you love there's, him? You there's people in that very boat right now, and he's sitting right next to me. Uh, <laughs> how do you love him? But how do you love him? But spread your legs for me. I mean. I'm missing something here. You want what? How do you love him, but you spread your legs for me? I do not spread my legs. You. What is my nickname? Cindy Titty. Cock yeah. I never slept with you. Hey, Missy. <laughs> does anybody? No, you never. Did I eat you out? Let's let's get real. Did I eat you out? Yes or no? Let's get real. No. Yes. Okay, Missy. Do you care to contest this? Let's get honest, man. I'm not getting involved. She's my best friend. Okay, so if she says she's not getting involved, that means the truth will get someone mad. So she can't say yes. Well, you know what? Nobody will never know that. <laughs> uh, wait, we have photos. How about no, that? Don't. If you lie one more time, I'm putting it on the internet right now. I swear to God. You got one more chance to not have it all over the internet. I swear to God, mark my words. And G's right here with the photos. <laughs> Did you let me eat your pussy? I will do it. I swear. No? Yes or no? Did I eat your pussy? No. Okay, you're fucked. Hey, Waffle Boy. I'm going well, what, to... What, it's going to be on Ryan G's site. After the show, Waffle Boy, <laughs> make yourself a fucking nice hot plate of 18 oh, waffles waffle and boy, stare at me it. eating your minging girlfriend's pussy <laughs> while you eat slowly and me. cry, you fucking homo. I'm over it, dude. dude you're you're fucked. I'm, I'm destroying you. Who do you hate more, Waffle Boy or... Natalie? Yeah. Minging puss? Kind of minging puss, man, because he's lying, man. <laughs> I don't like liars. You're like, what do you got to lie about? It's going up on RyanG.com. Oh, you're fucked now. No, that's <laughs> the wrong one. You're going to reroute it. Uh, no, no, I'm not. It's Ryan G. Photography. Uh, it's we got a lot more stories to talk about, dude. Mate, Matt, I'm sorry, sweetie. I'm not. <laughs> oh, that's all right. All right, well, let's hear some him. Late. I'm going to play him, It's All Tears, what devoted to... This is him, It's All Tears, devoted to Natalie and Waffle Boy. <laughs> and, uh, this, is, this is a 616 version, so they're even more doomed. Let's hear Radio Bams, here's 28. Yeah. Check this out, man. Say hello to everyone. Hello to everyone. Can I talk? Yeah, what's up, everyone? I didn't know you were recording this shit. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know it it's on. It's on the radio channel now. Nah. No. Yeah. You're fucking kidding me. You can't say that. I'm sorry. Serious 28 fashion. Uh, huh, buddy Bill. <laughs> uh, I uh, met and just left. And uh, I like the North Stars logo. It's pretty good. I like green and yellow. Is that... Was that the hockey team? Oh, it's pretty good. good Where are they from? They were from Minnesota, then they shipped them to Dallas. I don't like them anymore. Speaking of you liking hockey, I have this email that I'm going to read. <laughs> Yo, Deco, yeah. you hermit-ass piece of shit. What the fuck is up? Okay, well, forget the piece of shit part, but you're a fucking hermit. You never seem to go on any trips with the rest of the crew, and you seem to spend all your time at Kmart, Best Buy, and those other Ming holes that you hang out at. Anyways, you're probably one of the funniest motherfuckers ever, and we all know it, including Bam. And you need to take Rake's penis out of your ass and start going on trips. Now that you know... Now that you have a boner for Calgary and everything that goes along oh, with yeah. that city, since I am from Calgary, go Flames go, I am <laughs> going to say this. Fuck Make you your way up. to Calgary sometime during spring or summer. I will personally take you to Kmart's all over the city <laughs> and, and buy all the DVDs you want. <laughs> we can go to all the Best Buys yeah. and Zellers, and you can return Zellers. every fucking gadget you might own. <laughs> that was like, why would D I you go to Calgary to return to <laughs> <laughs> And not only that, your bitch ass can come to a Flames playoff game and experience th what a real hockey town is like. P.S. Bam, you, are you still thinking about filming that snowboard video out here? Oh, if, uh, blah, 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 yeah. blah. Dude, what do you have to say about yourself? Yeah. Well, everybody makes this offer. I don't see any tickets, though. 
Dude, yeah, that's true. It sounds like a broke back mountain. Yeah, Not he sounds gay as fuck. Yeah. I'm like, take it to Kmart, take it to hockey games. Yeah, what's that shit? I <laughs> like that stuff. Bam, did you see that? <laughs> I, I like that stuff. <laughs> Why do you like to wake up and just return VCRs and shit all day? <laughs> <laughs> Why do you I don't enjoy it. Anymore? It always fucking breaks. It's like, oh, shit. Buy a new one. Dude, I, I do, and it breaks. You just buy something and return it like every, on the hour, every hour, I bet. Just to go. Uh -uh. Did you see Brokeback Mountain? Uh -uh. Well, I don't want to see that. <laughs> I want to see it. We're all going when Landon gets off house arrest. <laughs> you guys are a bunch of flaming fags, dude. Calgary Flames. Eight would, dudes going to see a Would Landon seriously sit down and watch that? <laughs> it's going to be hysterical, dude. You think so? How is it good? It's going to be. I just don't want to see like two dudes caressing each other's well, face up on the top of a mountain. When <laughs> Landon is it's screaming. It's faggity. Even yeah. faggots would think it was faggity. How does I that get an Oscar, though? I don't get it. Because it's faggoty? Huh. Probably because they're not faggots, and the fact that they were being extra faggoty and they kissed like faggots, and they got an Oscar because they acted like they seemed like they were true faggots. Okay. And the director, yeah, I ripped his pay pay picture out of the paper. He was wearing a Calgary Flames hat. I have it on my refrigerator. I didn't even know it until the other day. It said Brokeback Mountain director. Yeah, the more you talk, I think you're like an undercover homo, man. You want to go out to this place with dudes to Kmart's and Dico's games. an undercover homo. Now you got pictures of men on your you fucking get some hate guys, mail from GLAAD. No. Did, you get guys. Yo, yo, did you get pussy last night? <laughs> yeah. I got pussy last night. Dick hates me, dude. I love it. Hey, what's Waffle Boy's name? Paul? Paul. Fuck Here's a note from Paul. He's Paul. from L.A., though, but it still hates it's you. Just as gay, I'm sure. Get that fucking Novak off your show. He sucks big time. <laughs> Every time I hear his voice, I want to put a bullet in my skull. Yeah. When does he get... When does he... When does the show alone, no chance I'm listening, I'd rather listen to the fucking classical station while giving my balls paper cuts. You're entertaining. He isn't. I could listen to more than ten minutes today because he sucks. Tell him to go blow some cock for drugs on Mondays instead of ruining your show. Loyalty and friendship is cool, but not fucking entertaining. Get him out of there. Now. Novak sucks. <laughs> P.S. Novak fucking sucks. Paul, guess Paul what? Paul from L.A. You're exactly right. Everything you said is true. And I'll probably get that tattooed on my arm. It's so fucking good, man. But it sucks so bad. The show, I get, why does he take... Uh, he called it. You why called does it take an hour of his day to write you that? You get the tattoo. You know? Fuck, like, what a homo. <laughs> Paul, you deserve to listen to classical music because you are boring and gay, probably. I want to thank Brandon Novak for giving me the confidence to talk to chicks. If an ugly, small dick drug addict like him can get chicks, anyone can. Although the ones I get have track mark don't have track marks on their arms and their beavers don't smell like Indian food. Unlike the girls, Novak gets Mark from Carbondale, Illinois. Yeah, Sounds like some Oprah Mark. Your name says it all plain, bro. Shut the <laughs> fuck up. Yeah. The thing is, people bag me, but I agree with everything. I fuck the dirtiest broads. I banged my mom out. The price is right. I, Sorry, I, mom. I've seen, I've seen that chick that you banged out last night. How about you going to Doyle's psycho. Town last night? Step, oh, dude. I get invited to this fucking kegger. I, I get invited to this kegger. And, I, and the dude's like, yeah, come party with us. I get there. As soon as I get to the top of steps, this girl's like, no. He will destroy the house. He's not allowed in here. So I'm leaving. <laughs> she's pushing me away. We get two blocks away. And she physically pushes me. I said, that's it, bitch. You touched me. <laughs> like, that's I, his reputation around here. I, 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 <laughs> I even went all the way to Doyle's town. <laughs> I, I threw my beer in her face. Then I hocked a Luger in her face. She said, oh, you think you're a tough guy? I'm like, I'm going to show you how tough I am. I'm spitting in your face four more times. <laughs> 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 and then didn't you, uh... Oh, and then more shit? Yeah, yeah, that was the beginning of the plan. So then me, I got two muscle-head steroid dudes. I got my back, you know, and our eyes. We go around the corner. <laughs> we put a game plan together. Go back. I pull the alarm. Kick the windows out. And try to steal the keg. But the dude called me and punched me in the face. <laughs> What's your bodyguards do? <laughs> I don't, my bodyguards, I don't, they were probably... Yeah, what bodyguards? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, they hated me. They hated me. Yo. Dico, be, being you uh, always go to Best Buy and you're going to the malls all over oh, the town. I don't like Best Buy so much. You don't? No. But what about Exton Mall? Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, and I went to finish line at Exton Mall to get some running shoes, <laughs> and I didn't try them on. I went home to put them on. They were too small. So I go back, and I, and I bought them the day before. And they're like, well... Do you have a receipt? I'm like, look, I don't want my money back. I just want a bigger size. These are tens. I want ten and a half. And they're just like, well, you have to have a receipt. Otherwise, how do I know that you got them here? I'm like, well, here's a pair of shoes, and they're sitting right there in your wall. And if you just give me a different pair of shoes, I'll be on my way. They're like, well, we can't do that, sir. I'm like, fine. Yeah. So I go, I'll buy those pair in ten and a half. So now I have two pairs of shoes in my hands. I walk out of the store. I come instantly back in. I go, the Could same you? lady. I go. Hi, I'd like to return a pair of shoes, and then I hand her, hand her the other shoes, and she's like, but these are the other ones. I'm like, okay, well, it says Air Max Triax Nike, 
and these are MX Triax. It doesn't say what size they are, so you're gonna have to return them. Did you return them? Fuck yes, you had to. She's been a drug awesome. addict, man. That's a good hustle. That is definitely good. But it wasn't even a hustle. Like it, it was a hustle. You yeah, but I didn't get my money back. I just got a bigger size. Okay. But you proved it wrong. Man. It's pretty oh, good. Oh, dude, idea. how stupid would you feel? I'm sorry, sir. We can't do that. Fine. You know what? I'll just buy a brand new pair of shoes. <laughs> and then it. you walk out of the store, <laughs> instantly pull a 180, and you're like, hello, ma'am, I'd like to return a pair of shoes. Here they are. They're size 10. <laughs> well, you just bought a 10 and a half. Well, it doesn't say that on the re this receipt now, does it? Because it doesn't say the size of the shoes. Yeah. It just says what kind of shoes you bought. And they don't have serial numbers. Oh, dude, she got them, fucking so. dogged. Yeah. I'm, I'm, uh, and you're mad, huh? Because I just chipped off the Exton Mall, and you love that place. Oh, no, no. He Granite Run, I love. You like Granite Run? Mm -hmm. Aladdin's Castle? You know there are games at the arcade <laughs> from when I worked there in like '93 are still in the fucking Are you sick? Where it tilt? Wing War. That game sucks. <laughs> you know why it's still in there? Because it's so big, nobody can move it. Really? And they got that. <sighs> this is like they swept uh, Bob. Bob, what do you want to do with this Wing War? It's from 1988. Oh fuck that heavy thing. Oh, just leave it. Yeah, but kids don't play it. Oh Christ, I ain't lifting that thing. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 wing I, War. Wing War. It sucks. I'd rather what, overdo What's the place called? Tilt. Tilt! <laughs> he said is that so in the Exton Mall? Huh? Or you say Grand Run? That's Exton. Tilt is an Exton. There's some other one in, in uh, Grand Run. Got Mortal Kombat 1. It's good. I don't really go in there. How do those places still stay in business? I don't <laughs> they don't have much. They don't have little <laughs> faggot kids that play that dance dance shit. Fucking keep them in business. <laughs> oh, that thing? Is that what works? That's a sin to do that to A kids. sin? <laughs> That's a sin. <laughs> I've seen people do that. It's it's. Maybe you should no. put your... I, 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 I probably should. Think should. Pressure. The one in King of Prussia used to be Spaceport. They don't have one anymore? They closed and I got out. They have no video games places. They don't like that. What about a Christianian mall? They got an arcade, I heard, but I only went to the parking lot and then I had to go back. What about Mac Dade Mall? Mac Dade Mall, yeah, I think there was like a t time out, I think. Maybe. Oh, I remember that place. Franklin Mills Mall. Yeah, there is one in Franklin Mills, I think. Springfield Mall. Springfield Mall is like dead bodies. That lady shot people. Do you go there. to the tax free malls? Oh, yeah, didn't that just suck. Yeah, that was a good arcade in Conquer Mall. Yeah. There was some good players in there. I'd rather fucking over this. I seen these three bags one time riding a so, motorcycle like, game in <laughs> unison with these tight ass jeans. And I was laying on the ground crying because one, she two, was three one would go. This <laughs> fat <laughs> <laughs> it was so awful. You know, you know if you would have just waited to see him get off the game, it would have been shit goose with a fucking fat ass. <laughs> 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 eating a fucking eating a cheesesteak. I know, with pepperoni. It looked like the clothes he wore in Haggard, them tight jeans with them white sneakers. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they were wearing. <laughs> I'm telling you, it was probably shit yeah, yeah, no. What are you doing about your weight, you worthless bastard? Fuck, dude, I'm I know, you look like Jared Leto right now. <laughs> yeah, just, dude, that, but there's no sense of trying to look good. Makes me look so much <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah. I don't even no, get no, it. But it's it's dude, check me out. That dude is up. fucking huge now, man. Dude, Don Dude, you know Phil Booth and Mum Mum combined couldn't make you look anorexic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, whatever. Start man. sticking your finger down your <laughs> throat, man. <laughs> hey, that's his best return, whatever. Yes. But the thing I know, is, seriously, whatever, dude. You same need to be shit. an anorexic, and then same when you're not shit. an anorexic, you need to be a bulimic. Every time I come up here, same shit. <laughs> fit us, fit us, fit. You know how to Who gives a fuck? I, I give a fuck. Tell I don't he doesn't like fucking you anymore. <laughs> oh, come on, man. No, he doesn't care. <laughs> we're we're hugging on today, riding the doom buggy. Yeah, yeah you know how. Yeah, yeah. And you're oh. like this thing has no horsepower. No, it's because your fucking three hundred pound <laughs> ass was sitting. <laughs> you know how they say like dudes are like, my girlfriend loves me for me. I'm always like, that's bullshit, dude. You got money or you like you're pretty. <laughs> G's thing here is his girlfriend loves him for him. She has to because he's so out of shape. Not Dude, attractive. I sold this BMW X5 for a shitty fucking Chevy. He's got a Chevy pickup truck. No, for a pickup truck. I got to haul the quads around. So man. you don't have money. Wait, I, and you're not <laughs> pretty. attracted to the quads because you don't drive them. You're not skinny. <laughs> what what the fuck does he like you for? You. And that's the only time I've ever seen that. To be Sometimes true. I wonder that myself. But fuck it. Me too. Let's <laughs> find out. Hey, babe. Why do you like him? Here she is. I'm hell. Oh, God, your debut on the radio. <laughs> Here's Kim's debut on the radio. <laughs> debut. A.K.A. Military War Dust. <laughs> <laughs> I'm even laughing. Oh, Why man. do you like Shit Goose? Because he's a great person. <laughs> I know 80 great people. Who? <laughs> well, Walk around Westchester. I know. <laughs> You'll find a bunch of great people. Oh, my God. What else? Go again. No, don't even talk. No, I mean, stop. Don't even, don't, yeah. Keep going, man. It's good. It's live radio here. We're all honest. Because he makes me laugh. But the thing is, she's pretty. She has other options. Like, Would why you out? Oh, yeah, dude. <laughs> but she's G's girlfriend, so I won't. Can't do that, man. That's the rule. <laughs> you can't, dude. What are you, a weed time, dude? 
I'm on K Pax time. <laughs> K Pax! <laughs> why, why don't you two have a threesome then? Huh? How can us two have a threesome then? <laughs> How's the sex, dude? Does he get tired in two minutes because he's so fat and out of shape? Oh, uh, no. what, what is the percentage of shit who's laying there and saying, Go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you ride me, Come on, I'm straight up. What, what is the percentage of him being like, Yo, Kim, I want to fuck. Go. A <laughs> hundred. <laughs> it down. makes you do all the work. Like, How yeah. much? What is the percentage? I don't even, it's gotta I, be 70. Jim, you don't talk. We want to hear the truth from yeah, her because you lie. Keep your mouth shut. Action, Kim. We need beer. <laughs> no, he goes pretty long. Yeah, right. Yeah. He does. What, does we, talk more. All right. Does he use cheat codes? <laughs> what, what, does he hump missionary D style or do you ride him the most? Which one? We mix it up a little bit. <laughs> I, I I like to be on top, so you know. Yeah, no so, shit. That works out perfect because this fat ass don't want to do any work. I like it, man. I like I like. I know like, you like it. I like just laying there, not doing nothing. I just get to sit there with a boner, and she just goes up and yeah. down. I only get. Yeah, I watch I don't, TV. I don't burn no calories or nothing. <laughs> Sounds like his whole yeah. day. I know. <laughs> no, I think I burned some shit off today, man. We, we, we I got, think that's we, like we try. Got, we got failure. failure. If I, you think that you burned off yeah. calories, you, you didn't. Whammy. No, I dropped in on the on the rent. What kind of Dropped in. Drop it in. <laughs> yeah, you do. Maybe if you would have pushed up the ramp, that would have been very good. Dropping in and feeling the nice breeze of wind isn't burning hey, any man, calories. Hey, it, man. It's some cardio going on. Dude. <laughs> it's some cardio going on. You know on. what? Dropping in on quarter. Shut the fuck up, man. I'm going to fuck you. <laughs> The thing is, is G's dad has some money, so he must hit her off with a check oh, every week to stay with his fat ass. What the heck? I don't get it, dude. You don't shoot photos. You don't make money. You ride what are you talking about? I was in fucking Europe you for fuck, like a month and a half. You fuck Kerry hey, Gets all day, basically. You suck a dick. Bam, dude, I'm hurting for cash. If you could get me that, like, MasterCard check for the photo that I took ages ago, that'd be so good because I want to see Nine Inch Nails in Massachusetts. I want to drive to the Atlantic City show. I want to drive to the Pittsburgh show. Then I'm going to try to drive to the Detroit show followed by the Cleveland show. They were well, not gee, how are you making money? Well, I'm not. I'm not? He okay. just drives to see the shows and pays for the tickets. What was your last paycheck, G? Fuck, I don't know. Yeah, day. exactly. You don't know. You don't remember. <laughs> what was it and how much was it for? Right now. Uh, right now. Two Quick. grand. Two grand. Two grand. And, and what was it for? For ads. Uh, uh, selling his dick. What fuck was it? Uh, eight, uh, workshop ads. <clears throat> no, 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 no. It was uh, Chris Cole ad. Uh, uh, you're boring now, G. You know what I don't get? Bodie Miller. That fucking hobo. <laughs> He's got a show on Sirius, and it is worthless, dude. I'd rather bang out my Who mom. is he? Who is that? Exactly. Who I mean, is he? I don't know. I never even heard I mean, of him. It's just, it's, it's basically, okay, here's Tupac, here's uh, Aerosmith, and here's um, Fuck you, man. Backstreet Boys <sighs> later. But who is he, though? <laughs> dude, I, he, I don't know. Apparently, he's some, <laughs> uh, he's apparently uh, some athlete. But he has no medals to show for it, I think. I don't think oh, he's a skier. <laughs> what are you yeah, talking dude, about? You know who he is? <laughs> what? I, I just forgot. Talk, talk geek. Well, no, you, you know that adult theater? It's always in the newspaper. says the art holiday. <laughs> just call <laughs> Novak art holiday. For now. <laughs> <laughs> I always look to see the names of the movies. Is that right here? <laughs> What's that, that mean? Where is that at? It's, um, it's, it's around here? It's on uh, Frankfurt Ave. I read it today when I was in, um, getting that chicken sandwich. Wait, Frankfurt Ave? Really? <laughs> I love getting yeah. that chicken sandwich. <laughs> Art Holiday, you know, you know what I'm talking about? If you you want to see the best movie names, if you got a paper, there's nothing else to read. You've already seen Calgary and the Flyers are in first. How's the undergirls doing? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can never even talk. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Serious, 28 factions. I'll shut uh, up. I won't see you yeah. anymore. All right, I'm I want to play another hymn song. This whole episode is devoted to him. Fuck it. I'm playing... Uh, what am I playing? I'm playing... An old one that no one's heard. It's called "I've Caused Oceans of Wine to Find You." Here, oh, oh. Let's try the wine. <laughs> try the wine. This is we're going hot right now. Oh, oh. Stop. Run for your life. That's what we found in Don Vito's ass. Oh, no. This is Radio Bam, baby. Oh, Faction Twenty Eight. What's your name? Uh, Kelly. Kelly. Uh, Kelly. I think it's you. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Kelly. <laughs> Hello. Speak. Can you hear me? Yeah, baby. Hello. No wonder you don't get, no wonder you don't get pussy. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> What's going on? Hey, Kelly. Nothing. How are you guys going? Uh, we're doing good uh, because we just, um, Novak just uh, told off some girl named Natalie and it was funny. Did, are you listening right now? You no, know, well, it doesn't come on here until later. We have to get a download for it. So I've just been listening while I've been on hold. <laughs> Wait, you sound foreign. Okay. Where are you from? You <laughs> sound foreign. She's from Australia. Huh. Yeah. Cool. That's why and I thought him, I was like, how the hell? Where? Him are coming here next week, and we we're wondering if any of you guys are going to be there. That's um, too yes. expensive. Uh, no, I'll, I'll, oh, I'll, the I'll, beer's I'll, here. Shut up, shit goose. Well, uh, what I'm did you say? I, uh, oh, G, 
G's all excited because excited there's beer here, but um, that's more that's more we're, calories. We're filming, for the gut. we're filming Jackass in LA for Jess. like the next two weeks, so I can't make it. Just get me. What about for CKY? When are they coming? On the 21st of April. Jess, you're Jess, you're, you're playing in Australia. Are you, are you playing in Australia? Don't ask. I just told you that like three times. Man, tell me when are you going? You know he did. The band's got in April, day, man. April when? Uh, Mid April to the end of April. Well, we're talking to somebody from Australia you right now. Need a now. photographer. Yeah, we're. What and town? Are, what, what town she are you has from? Tickets already. Oh, uh, what yeah, town? Yeah, we've got them. Sydney. Fuck yeah. Sydney. Yeah, that's gonna be a good show. Yo, yeah. you need, like they're all a good Kelly. show. I know they all are. Stop sucking Gee, I like that you. Fuck. <laughs> so, um, will any of you guys be coming out, or are we going to miss out on you? Miss out. Uh, Jesse, you want this? Oh uh, uh, yeah, uh, Jeff, I, I I might go to the CKY one because uh I, I won't be filming at that point. But uh, why not? Because I'm filming Jackass right now. Don't you listen, shit? Yeah, we're playing with the Moist Boys. I've been away too long, long, man. Uh, really? Yeah. We just saw the Moist Boys. Oh, uh, dude, it's gonna yeah. be awesome. Moist. Can't wait. And Hannah's band's playing, and Hoof bands. Hoof bands. No shit. Bro. Yeah. Right on, dude. All right, uh, Kelly. I'm gonna I'm gonna play some hymn for you later on. Thanks but, for calling, Kelly. Uh, thank yeah, you. thanks for it calling so from nice Australia. I'll see you in Sydney. I'm really looking forward to that flight. 22 hours. It's gonna be awesome. Take, Take drugs. Yeah. Take a K-Pax. <laughs> Take a K-Pax. <laughs> right, yeah. All right. It was nice to see you. <laughs> <laughs> why did you call it a K-Pax? <laughs> I don't know. What is K-Pax? K-Pax? That movie. I don't know. I just called it that. Yo, ma'am, I just took K-Pax. Now I'm sipping on a rolling bag. Yeah. yeah. I love when Deco just chimes uh. in. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Man, you guys are really like Pennsylvania beer fanatics. Uh, I'm so into it now. It's just like... Well, I was a religious shrine in my apartment, just Rolling Rock. And that's from PA. Yeah, it's just like oh, sure. Rolling Rock and Yingling. That's all they got. Yingling what, Rock. What about Paps? Isn't that? I hate people that drink PBR. Yeah, that P- shit gets PBR. me PBR actually it ain't bad. PBR is not bad because oh, like it's oh, only shit. fourteen dollars for a fucking thirty pack, man. It tastes, like, it tastes like probably sucking my dick. Dude, you wake up with a <laughs> worse headache drinking that shit. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. Yes, I bought this BB gun today to oh. to shoot at kids at the gate when they ring the gate at three in the morning. Where'd you get Fuckers it? Fuckers start shooting I, at I, us. I, I went out to the deck and the van is all the way parked at the Hobbit Hall. I was like, dude, this thing is pretty far, man. Check it out. I'll try to hit the van. I just go. The oh, window just goes. <laughs> oh, and I'm like, shattered. Brad, dude, <laughs> we just I fucking busted the van window just to test to see how far that BB gun can shoot. We just took that van to go get beer right now. <laughs> did you notice the hole in the back? Yeah, yeah the window's completely. Were you like, what the hell happened? Like, yeah, yeah, you're trying to shoot that fucking. Did you man. ask? Yeah, I was like, what the hell's going on with the window? And who responded? <laughs> Shitbird. I was like, like your fucking shot brother shot out. the goddamn window. We out. just bought BB guns on tour on that last tour we were on just to freak out all the metalcore kids. I bought BB guns and kayaks today. Yeah, and I bought a trailer to. It off. Dude, that was fun. Oh, we, had, we had a blast We're, today, man. <laughs> it was fun. Dude, man. we went floating down the brain. Went, it's supposed to thunderstorm tonight, and if you were, were, we're a going. pussy, you, or a you were going. Oh, it gets awesome. Oh, you, you, you got a kayak go. with us? He has his own kayak. I'm Shit, kayak. are you a pro? Do you extreme kayak? Helmets? <laughs> <laughs> with a helmet? Dico, you, you want to go extreme kayaking with us? Mm-hmm. Or you no, can you put, don't. <laughs> that means no. Hey, I'm going, so you got to do it naked. You got to go. Broke back kayak, uh-huh. greasy broke back mountain. <laughs> Let's go broke back kayak. <laughs> broke back kayak, <laughs> man. It would just be fucking floating down some pussy ass river with no current, just caressing each other's faces. How, how many? Mi- did you guys go like a mile or something? Or how yeah, far? At least, caressing at least. faces is gay, but caressing Jeez. faces on a mountain with cowboy hats is really gay. <laughs> Watching the sunset. That gives cowboy. Watching the fucking sun go down and you, shit. You ever wonder how pissed <laughs> cowboys are after that? Fucking Jeez, stop out? fucking Shut talking. You bore me, dude. The Marbo man is not me. happy right. Now, uh, the Marvel man is sitting in Wyoming, just like, what the fuck, man? What the fuck? We're not like this, right, guys? <laughs> the Marvel. When I didn't say right, right guys. guys, it's just like, please agree with me. <laughs> right We're guys? not like this broke back shit, right, guys? <laughs> when, when Uncle Matt and Shipbirds goes on tour, I want to get fucking Philip Morris and Budweiser to sponsor the fucking tour. Yeah, that would be amazing. the best tour ever. All right, no, off, the top, the Yingling tour. off the top of everybody's heads right now, if you had to break into a house, DiCamello, whose house would you break into and why? Go. <laughs> Good question. Answer. <laughs> Fucking rakes because they don't even lock the door. <laughs> <laughs> so why would you break in? What would you take? There ain't shit to take. I'd take rake and throw him the fuck out the window. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Shipbird, if you had to break into anybody's house in the world, who would it be and why? Now. Uh, yours because I know everything is. <laughs> 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 yeah, good answer. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, Shikers, who would you, whose house would you break in? Trent Reznor's, because I love him. I, <laughs> I, I would just, I'd, I'd kick down your garage door and take the Lambo. That's why I would Lame do. answer. <laughs> Jess, whose house would you break into? Jimmy Iovine, the president of Interscope Records, because he has the Strawberry Fields piano, and it was 
so awesome. I got the plant and I wanted it. So I'd steal that shit. I'm <laughs> I would I'd fucking break what into Bill Gates' house and take his fucking safe. And I'd fill with money and diamonds. Oh, <laughs> yeah. 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 Who's, who's, all right, Novak, whose would you break into? <laughs> Stupid question. The, the, the DuPonts, they make <laughs> prescription pills. They got oh, more yeah. pills in that house than anybody. <laughs> I'm filling the bag yeah. up with pills and leaving the cash and partying. <laughs> I break into my own house. <laughs> that's that's actually a pretty throat. good idea. I'm doing it. Dude, the DuPonts right. just have so many fucking random pills, by the way. If you, like, <laughs> them, if you don't know who the DuPonts are, they own 50% of Delaware. Because they uh, they created gunpowder back in. Uh, they created gunpowder. They, they also make uh, chemicals. They Teflon, make random pills. They make everything. They make chemicals. Dude, no wonder why the whole family's fucking crazy. No, they probably they test all these pills. Oh, like, no, you know why they're fucking they crazy? Dude, why? Because they try and keep the money in the family, so uh, they like marry into the family. It's like inbreeding. No, yeah, that, but yeah. that probably that probably came with it with the pills. Like, dude, <laughs> yeah. think about it. Back in the seventies, when when they're just like seventies. <laughs> back in the seventies, when they're telling their kids like, "Here's a new pill we invented. It's called Xanax. Try it, kid." Yeah. Now they're all freaked and shit because they've been taking it since they were fucking five. And they're like, "Oh, I like my what? sister. I want to fuck her. Let's marry." Yeah. Did you hear about the the son who went AWOL and drove the tank around on his front lawn and shit? Oh, did we? No, he drove the tank around his front lawn. Yeah. He fucking ravaged everything. He oh, and Didn't then you he, guys go there. Listen, ass wait, quick, cut me off. Then he shot his gay tennis player boyfriend. That's it. Yeah, yeah. He shot him, and he's dead. He's dead now. He didn't, yo, Listen. he didn't go to jail. Guess where he went? What? To a mental institution. <laughs> Guess what it's called? The Dupont Mental Institution. Ah. All that means is, oh my God. it's like if Jesse Margera killed somebody. I'm like, don't worry, Jesse Margera. We're gonna put you in a Margera Mental Institution. <laughs> yeah. Have fun and play, I Jesse. Just have hang have out. fucking fun and go outside and play around. Go play more man. tennis. Like they're not gonna be on to you stealing a TV. Yeah. Like, I remember when that has, oh, man. Has, has, has the state of Delaware figured that out? Like, oh, don't worry, he's safe in a mental institution. Yeah, a DuPont mental institution. <laughs> yeah. That means he's driving a Ferrari all around town. <laughs> Another one of the DuPonts yeah, is so crazy that she wears trash bags. She doesn't believe in clothes. She, she, that she has millions. <laughs> Serious. Oh, really? Dude, I'm telling you, when you have billions and you own half of Delaware, you probably just do shit like that. Like, you know what? I'm going to the bar and I ain't even going to wear any clothes. I'm going to wear a trash bag. You live in your own world. Yeah, yeah totally. Billions. Well, they invented <laughs> matter, so they're no one can matter. fuck with them. They're loaded. <laughs> invented carbon. Damn, open up a prison. Man, so when I go, I can do whatever the fuck I want. <laughs> would you, would fuck you hang you? out with the Duponts if they gave you a chance? I'd suck their dicks just for them pills, man. <laughs> Dude, <they're all> <laughs> the man, I got drugs forever with them people. Actually, I think I'm moving over there later, man. Broke the Novak Mountain. <laughs> Dude, they straight up just make all kinds of pills and then they have like research testing. Th Dude, the whole family is fucking tweet. They're out of their mind. They own that cold house in Delaware. We the, went? the devil's cold house where they have those seances and shit. Well, dude, I it's remember when you, when you mentioned that tank and the dude shooting the guy. That was like down the, a I couple towns that. away from Go down Route 52 no. towards Delaware. Cut a left you know on Cozart really Road. You'll see that there's a fucking house with trees lined up the whole way. They have a house with upside down crosses in it. They have seances. <laughs> I've been in there <laughs> with How? that. How? You know what's, it's not seances. You know what it is? What? Please tell They me. have the e the next Xbox and they just don't want anyone. Uh, yeah. <laughs> they got that shit so far yeah. ahead. They got, so they, they got great out with Donald Trump. Yo, if you want to know about <laughs> it's, that, it's <laughs> awesome, dude. Shit. You should we see have the controller for that one. It's not coming out till 2007. What should we do? Let's say that we're having seances in it. Put upside down crosses <laughs> the windows. Nobody will ever come in to hear. It's called the, see that. It's called the triple Xbox. <laughs> we have the 2007 Xbox. We don't want anybody to rip that shit off. <laughs> that going That's the reason it. why there's upside down cross. We have the Xbox 720 in there. I climbed up the window. They were just eating like. Dominoes and Doritos oh, and like Coke, and Pepsi and like. What's out now? The Xbox 360. They got cares? the Xbox 720. Yeah. <laughs> it's not called that. It's, it's called something else. Yeah. The Xbox Phantasm. I hope the oh, video industry. Who wants to hear Private Line? <laughs> whammy. This is Private room. Line, and it's called. <laughs> Why does he yell Love me? <laughs> whammy. This is Radio Bam, and we're gonna talk about more sick, disgusting shit. So here's 28 Faction. Don't change. Yeah. Fuck. Here is 28 Faction. <laughs> Yeah. Dear Bam, hey, 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 sexy, how are you? I am a single 24-year-old girl, I'm 53 feet and 115 pounds of green eyes, tan with some freckles like splattered dots of crap, long red hair that makes you want to vomit, live, not I live, but live in a shit town called Round Lake. Ironically, it's an octagon. <laughs> 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 it's an hour away from Chicago. Boy, is it windy. Or so I've heard. My friend my friend and I are planning to take a trip to Westchester. Man. And we're yeah, and we are kind of hoping to run into you. I have a question for you now. <laughs> Would you meet and fine ass girl? And she has spelling as atrocious as mine that you like, and she has the hots for you. 
Will you do her? As in do it? Or do it to her? Or let her blow you away? I want to kill you. I want to blow you away. <laughs> I don't know, Missy. Can, can I? Fuck no. <laughs> <laughs> well, can I? You fuck? Yes. Why don't they send in photos? Like, Yo, fuck photos. Just uh, get the fuck over here. I'll bang you out of your 800 pounds of no teeth. Would you bang uh -huh. out those girls? Yeah. So basically, you're saying out if any girl is listening to this Gee, radio thanks. show, if they drive to Westchester and see you and they go, hey, Novak, I want to fuck, you'll do it. Any man or woman, if I'm drunk. If I'm drunk <laughs> enough, man, any woman, bring it on, dude. Buddy Bill! What if it's, it's Buddy Bill? <laughs> Novak well, likes fucking blown out. Novak, assholes. has you officially graduated to batting for both teams now, or what's going uh, on? Yeah, Tull. If the price is right. Jess, I just don't give a fuck. <laughs> He's a cat. Life is boring. If some dude wants to suck my dick, Jess. It feels just like a girl. Who gives dude, a shit? Novak, close your eyes. Mouse and up, man. Mouse and mouse. Stay up. It's warm. It's got heat. Fuck it. Yeah. Life is boring when you care too much, man. If you just don't care, everything's a party. Yeah, did you yeah. max out your credit card yet? Max oh. it out, dude. They basically repoed it from me. <laughs> like, on that Listen, subject, that's amazing. Dear Brandon, which is for me. Fuck not, them, man. No, no. I know. Me. I know. I'm jealous, though. Uh, you're a pussy son of a bitch midget vagina. Mm. You're not funny, and your Viva La Bam show is scripted. No shit, it's scripted. I did 44 episodes, and and fucking MTV has, like, Pepsi make commercials. They want to be guaranteed that they have a show, faggot. I can't just film whatevs. <laughs> of course it's scripted, you fucking piece of shit. <laughs> respect your fucking folks. Respect my folks. If I respect my folks, I wouldn't have 44 episodes, and they wouldn't have a nice house that's fully paid for. Whoa. Asshole. Look Jesus at Bam going on. I like you're that. such a badass. <laughs> woo, woo. You're such a badass. You pull pranks on your parents then give them money to make up for your moral flaws no shit i give them fucking money if i can fuck around with my parents and then re repay return all their shit if i fuck their vibes up and then give them another vibes who the fuck gives a shit Good everybody grandma. winds up with money this dude is a moron look at bam going off i like it get like some it. nuts you boner butt and get real if you want to fight email me back pussy weed <laughs> <laughs> ian ian it's probably ian man that fat <laughs> yeah, fuck it probably that is. fat fucking piece of shit <laughs> that fat fuck is so bummed out at the world that he's got to write shit and I just dogged him right you there. You can tell he has nothing going on if he has just time to bite you. Just the fact that he said boner, but he's a fucking fat faggot. <laughs> he's obviously got a lot of time on his hands to invite you to a fist fight. Is he fatter than me? The skull looks a lot yeah, better. Yeah, he is. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> he's probably his brother. He's probably his brother. I remember that asshole call. Remember when he called up WISP and he, and he, and he said that uh, all BAM CKY videos are fake. Da -da 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 -da. What a <laughs> fucking faggot. Ian Mann is a faggot. That guy's gayer than a bag of dicks. And now he's probably sucked your dick. And the thing was, I liked him at the time, and I couldn't believe that he would do that. I know. He was just, like, jealous before I even didn't even like he him. He was. Anymore. He was totally over it because his band didn't fucking do shit, and then ever... Of course it didn't yeah. do shit. He's a fat fuck. Who's gonna <laughs> buy his record? <laughs> fat <laughs> equals unmotivated. Jared unmotivated Lito, Jared Lito's broke. fat now, and he's performing next week, so... You're fun. fat. Stop sticking up for fat people. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, fam, Let I'm me. sick of Let all me. this... Missy Pop Tart shit. What are you doing with Missy? Pop that hot dog stricken fuck face floozy. She, she looks like she was pooped out by a Russian bear. You, you should be better off with a 29 year old can of salt and vinegar Pringles. She, if she looks like something like Bob Saget shit out, she will wreck worse than Rake's snaggle hair mixed with wolf urine and chocolate omelet in a hot yeah. Georgia sun with chocolate soup and seaweed. That's a she looks like sentence. some piece yeah. of shit trailer trash you should find sleeping in on the freeway playing. Girls just want to have fun yeah, on I a like four dollar tape player. She looks like someone out of Cats play. Like someone Bin Laden shit shaved up for 42 days. Heating it up in the microwave smeared it onto Vince Vaughn's gulch and licking it off. <laughs> Vince it's, Vaughn. It's like eating Vito's shit pancake that was squeezed between his mink and ass cheeks. Ew, man. Dang queer. I like him. I well, think he has wait. your girlfriend mistaken with mine. I love how Ray got Dude, dragged that, into that. Isn't that like the, like the tenth email? <laughs> Missy. <laughs> Missy. I gotta, I gotta get that tattooed on my ribs. Dude, I, <laughs> the whole sentence. You need a you pay for him to write a blog. Fuck tattooed on you. Oh, that was brilliant, G. Yes, yeah. who writes Good one, G. That's, oh, you gotta see right. Buddy Bill's new I, tattoo, dude. He's what got is? Buddy Bill's new tattoo. He got a huge sword. I was like, yo, you had to get naked with the tattoo, man, to get that. Because it goes all the way down. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, no, I take my boxers over my jokes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right. Yeah, right. <laughs> Buddy Bill is He's listening now. Hey, is he listening? Yeah, he's listening. I didn't know he was listening. He was at my house. Tell him to call us. Yo, Buddy Bill, call.
Bill, what did Bill call in? Uh, 877 porn 877 bag. porn bag. Tell Dude, us Buddy how you're Bill either. always gets so out of control drunk that he just breaks shit. So even like, he came to our Phoenix show at the Marquee Theater and he came on the bus and I had to kick him off the bus. Dude, he, he came on the bus and yeah, you it homo. Uh, I think, I think, <laughs> Your uh, marriage is a front. You're gay. Shippers, did you clean I, it up? Uh, yeah. I think Shippers did clean it up. It was on a linoleum, so I mopped it up. <laughs> <laughs> right, man. I, thought, I thought he lived in like Colorado or some shit. We got, yo, did you get we had baby wipes on the bus. No, back did you ever get that massage? <laughs> That kind of square bitch? Oh, uh, nah. Why not? I was just blew it off. Why? What a bill call. Because I was trying to get pussy, dude. Trying, did which you? I didn't. Are you trying to get a happy ending at the end? Yeah. <laughs> uh, stupid question, yeah, bro. You got a, didn't you get a massage dude, the other day? Right by K&G Pizza, there's a massage joint that, that you could get uh, jerked off because Vito's addicted to the joint. He goes every second. Oh, yeah. 80 bucks with a guaranteed yeah, Let me borrow 80 bucks, dude. <laughs> yes. And I was telling him about this when we were at Pacific Blue and the King of Fresh Mall and Hoof Pate was with us and Hoof State and Olivia. Yeah. And he's like... He's like, damn, man, I gotta do that. 80 bucks, that's it? He goes, Huff, you wanna go? And he's like, no, I don't wanna go. He's like, don't worry, Huff, I won't tell Olivia. I won't tell Olivia about the shady things that you have done that I know about. But remember, I know. Look, just the fact that he kept going on with it, like, don't worry, Huff, I won't tell Olivia about the shady things that you've done that I know about. I I have you seen the, the, the cops on it? Place. It's so much worse. Have you seen the Friendly's commercial, you know, Friendly's restaurant? Dude, they were running a commercial for happy ending desserts. Oh, no! No one knows what I'm talking about. Happy ending, yeah, yeah. And they you know what I'm talking about? I went in to get a menu. It doesn't say nothing about it. And menu. come on in for a happy ending. <laughs> Literally, dessert. come in. Dude, every time I go to get a cup of coffee, because the coffee joint is right next to the Asian massage parlor, there's always cop cars there. Pico, you want to get a Pico, will you get a happy ending with me tonight? Let's go to this place. They probably sprinkle Reese's penis all over the top. Bam, you got a massage the other day. Peanuts. Did you fall on your head and go and get a massage? <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah, no answer, no answer. <laughs> Ding dong! I want to hear, hear Venus and our blood by him. This is the him episode, as far as I'm concerned. I don't think anybody's heard this one yet either, unless you bought it. the uh, special one that they only printed 20,000 copies of. Let's hear it. Radio Bam Series 28 Facts, and then we're going to talk more shit. Yeah. eBay.com. Amazon. <laughs> 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 Radio Bam. That's our son. What's up? I'm April Margera. Hi, this is Phil Margera, Bam's dad. Call Radio Bam now at 877 Porn Bag. That's 877 porn bag. Why are we doing porn bag? It's easy to remember. That's horrible. That's our son. That's horrible. I guess dial it to call in, but that's horrible. Why don't you read the line? Oh, no. On Faction 28. Abe, come here. <laughs> Yo, Abe, uh, Abe, just so you know, my, uh, my Lamborghini is getting shipped to London, and I'm driving to Thailand, and then they're shipping it from Thailand to Hong Kong. Hong Wait. Kong to Salt Lake City, and then I'm driving to, uh, yeah, it's official. Am I going on there with Gumball you? Gumball Rally. Am I going on there with you? Dunn is. I need to make You asked me, me to go on with you, you fag. Dunn was like, please let me go. Yeah, what do you think about it? I think it sucks. I don't like that idea one bit. Who, who's driving with you? Me. And Dunn. No, yeah. no, no. Yeah, no. Dunn, because no. you have such a good record no, when it comes to Dunn. driving. Dunn <laughs> you into like eight. Eight times into oncoming traffic, you had to be helicoptered out. No, absolutely no. He's been trying to kill your kids for years, and no. Bam, promise me. Thanks, Gumball. Bam. I got in a car with Ryan Dunn, and I was oh, wondering why I'll, the fuck Let's get I into did. a pissing match. Let's call up Dunn. All right. No, we, we don't have time, actually. He still drives like a total a asshole. Why do we got to say bye? <laughs> say goodbye. It's only Ellis's show. Who the fuck cares is coming on next? Say goodbye. <laughs> I'm sure they'd rather hear some All right, fun. say goodbye, everybody, because I'm ending this with the placebo song. It's Jessel uh, Toe! Oh! Yeah, New Narkill! New Narkill Nar coming out soon. New Narkill, Jessel Toe, Matt and the Shipbirds, yeah. and Naked Rich Boats and fight no with a chair. Tom Rock. <laughs> Later. Tom Rock, Casey's got an Oilers hat. Oh, my God, oh, my God. Hey, wild boy, suck that's Radio Bam for this week. We're done. Tune in next week for more. You can leave now. It's Radio Bam. Radio Bam every Monday. Radio Bam every Monday, 7 Eastern, 4 Pacific. Email me now at Radio Bam. Why don't you uh, take a picture of your sweet white ass and send it on over to Radio Bam at Sirius-Radio.com. Call Radio Bam at 877-PORNBAG. That's 877-PORNBAG. Sweet dreams, Peapod. Bye, everybody. See you next week. On Sirius 28 Faction. Later. Fault Radio. Playing the best rock. 24-7.